They're right behind us. Less than half a league. You were right, my lord. I know that snot-nosed bastard Griff. He was sent to kill me, not Roderick. He wouldn't run home to his father without trying again. Listen close! I want the road surrounded. Ride hard for Ironrath, and don't turn back. If this goes to hell, they'll need to know about Roderick. Yeah! Lay low and be ready to strike the moment I give the order. And what order is that, Asher? Pain the road with their blood! Seven hells! Take them! Kill the Protestants! No grip. Oh, he's a bloody coward. Yeah, your brother was the coward. You should have seen him squeal. When Griff gutted him like a pig. <laughs> My lord. We're going to kill them all for this. Roderick. I wish I had known him, Asher. I'll never get to drink with him, fight by his side. Complain about what an ass his little brother is. People loved him. If he said a thing, people believed it. Roderick. He kept this house together through, through sheer force of will. And my brother was a true lord. They'll sing songs about him someday. But you're the lord here now, like it or not, by the laws of your land. And to these men, you've more than proven yourself. Roderick was meant to rule, not me. Father groomed him from the day he was born to make our choices. And Roderick chose to save you. It's up to you now to honor that choice. We have to go, my lord. And Lord Whitehill will be on the march. Let's move! How could this happen? It makes no sense. He died a hero. Gregor was a hero. Ethan was a hero. Now Roderick? It means nothing to me. It was his sacrifice that enabled us to escape. The last time I saw him, I stormed out of the room. Talia, mother. Listen to me. 
We don't dare take time to mourn. Not yet. Lord is sure to move quickly now. He could be at our gates before nightfall. But there's hope yet! I've brought help! Warriors from across the narrow sea! With no equal in Westeros! Whatever their skill, they are hardly an army. My lady, I've seen them twice in battle. I've seen Asher lead them. They're a force to be reckoned with and will be more than equal to whatever Lud could muster. How can you say that? We've already lost. What are you talking about? Ramsay Snow. He came here. He set terms of war. He said the last house standing wins. And with the Lord of House Forrester dead. I fear she's right. By the terms put forth by the Boltons, we don't have a claim. Oh, fuck Ramsay Snow. Fuck the Boltons! This war is not over until I say it is! Asher will lead us! Asher is our lord! Asher, I wish this were a happier occasion, but this sword has been held by a forester lord for centuries. Now, it is yours. All hail Asher Forester, Lord of Ironrath, defender of the Ironwood Groves. I never claimed to be the leader my brother was. He was the true lord of this house. But I do know how to fight. And by the gods, we will avenge him! <laughs> Mira told us he was gathering an army. We have her to thank it's not bigger, but we can't fight that. He doesn't expect us to. He's trying to frighten us into surrender. I want every bolt aimed at Lord Whitehill the moment he appears. Ryan! Crossbows up! Asher Forrester! Show your face, boy! Ryan! He's frightened, father. On ya! <laughs> well, Lord, you must not have much faith in this army of yours if you feel the need to hide by my little brother. <laughs> you mistake me, Forrester. Ryan is here for your protection, to stop you from being stupid. You see, I'm here to end this once and for all. You got your little revenge on my men, but it's time you listen to reason. I could ram your gates down and kill every last one of you. Or we could end the bloodshed here and now. This war is over, Asher. It ended the moment Roderick fell. By Ramsay's rules, I'm the victor here. This will all be mine now. One way or another. You put too much stock in Ramsay's terms, Lord. Terms set by a madman. Terms that I never agreed to. You really think Lord Ramsay will ask if you're in favor of his terms before flaying you alive for breaking them? 
Let's put all this ugliness behind us. I'm willing to talk terms of your surrender. Surrender? Open your halls and bend the knee as my bannermen. You continue to produce ironwood under my supervision, of course. And you will join your house to mine for all to see by wedding my Gwyn. <laughs> well, fuck me. Asher, you can't. That would be easier to believe coming from Gwyn herself. Where is she? Far away from all this, of course. Besides, I speak on her behalf as her father. I will just as happily kill you all and be done with it. But I'm very generously giving you a way to keep your bloody lives. Oh, one last thing. As a show of my goodwill, I've brought home the body of your lord. Your brother was too stubborn to know when it was over. Roderick, let me see him. I want to see my brother. <clears throat> I'm sure your people will be relieved to keep their lives. We'll take Ryan too. But you want peace between our houses? Give me my living brother. You have an hour. I'll be waiting in my camp. I'm sorry, little brother. I've buried too many sons. I should have been here. I should have come home faster. Don't blame yourself, Asha. Blame the fucking bastards outside that wall. Forgive me, I, I just... Perhaps the time has come to truly let this bloodshed end. We simply accept. We bow our heads and Asher marries Gwyn. Craven! It's not the worst terms I've ever heard. I can't bow my head to the fucking White Hills after all they've done. I may have loved Gwyn, but... No. No, not like this. Even if you went through with it... Lud would have you killed the moment Gwyn produced an heir. There will be no marriage. If we bow our heads now, we'll always be his slaves. We have to kill them, Asher. Aye, piss on surrender. Let's ride out and kill them all. Aye. We ride for war! We ride! Spill their blood! Believe me, I want to kill every last fucking one of them. But Lud still has Ryan. A direct attack is a sure way to see another forester dead today. But there may be another way we could win this. Lord rules that house with an iron fist. His sons, his bannermen, do nothing without his say-so. There may be 500 men outside that wall. Without Lord at the lead. They'll scatter like chickens with their heads cut off. That's good, but how? Lud will not simply cast aside his men and offer his neck. Such a task is easily said, but Lud is wary. We tell Lud exactly what he wants to hear. We invite him inside to celebrate and drink to our union. And then? An ambush. 
Your pit fight is hidden until the last moment. No, an ambush is too chaotic. Things could go badly quickly. Lod could escape. There's another way. Poison. In his wine. A woman's weapon. Yes, and a good one. Lethal and direct. Neither plan is high risk. We only lure Lod inside if the whole family is there to sell it. Talia and Ryan will both be in danger. We're already in danger. I'll be there, Duncan. I'll pour the wine myself. Poison is dog shit. You're here for revenge. You want him to choke on your blade, not his vomit. But I understand what's at stake. But poison is the surest way to see Lord dead. Then we have a plan. Whatever happens to me, I need you to get Ryan out alive. As soon as we move on, Lord. Not a problem. You know you're the only family I've ever had. That makes Ryan my brother, too. I won't forget this. I've forgotten the number of times I've heard you say that. I've said that before. We will avenge Roderick's death tonight, whatever it takes. Send word to Lod. We'll drink this night to the prosperous future of our united houses. The wine is ready, my lord. Your sister will pour. Once they're all seated, give the signal. Remember, no matter how much they might provoke you, we must let them think they've won. That's them. Here we go. Gwyn. Clever. Send the girl first. Don't let her play with your head, little brother. Lady Forrester. My apologies for arriving unannounced. I was hoping I might have a word in private with Asher. I think we can agree these are not ideal circumstances. Agreed. But these are the circumstances we find ourselves in. I know how you must feel, Asher. What your family has suffered, it's unimaginable. Which is why the bloodshed must stop. I agreed to your father's terms, didn't I? You did. But I know you, Asher. You're not the one to roll over so easily. You don't like being pushed into a corner. It's not in your nature. I don't need your sympathy. I agree to your father's terms, that's all there is to say. I wish I could believe that. But I know you too well. You have to understand. I've risked everything to bring peace between our houses. To meet with Roderick in secret. To tell him of the traitor within these very walls. To make sure no harm came to Ryan as our ward. All while persuading my father the bloodshed would end if we were to wed. I have no ulterior motive. No hidden agenda. Just peace. Once and for all. Your brother is too unpredictable. It just as soon slit my throat as see us wed. And I can't forget that he was the one who killed my brother. That was before. I'll see Griff exiled if that would put your mind at ease. Truth be told, my father's scared of you. Is he? With Roderick, he knew who and what he was dealing with. But you, he thinks you're dangerous. You proved as much when you attacked his men. They came after us. I know. And that's all in the past now, I promise. We can make this work, Asha. This is our one chance. Together we can control the future of our houses. Just promise me, when my father and brother walk through that door, nothing will happen that could threaten that future. Our future. I need your assurance. Nothing will happen. And at this point, it's in the hands of the gods. Begging your pardon, my lord. I'm afraid Lady Forrester requires your help. Of course. 
I should go. What help does my mother need? Sorry, my lord. It was the best I could think of. But we have everything in place. How should we proceed? Ready the poison. Of course, my lord. I'm sorry it's come to this, but at least it's done. Where's my son? Right to it, then. Hammered out the details of your surrender. Uh. Lord Whitehill. Asher. Now, who'd ever have imagined this? You welcoming me into your hall to drink your wine and call me father. <laughs> I thought I'd see the last of you when Gregor shipped you off to the other side of the bloody world. You honor us, Lord Whitehill, with your presence. And with this union. Honor you? I didn't take you for an arse licker, Forrester. Father, don't bicker. Asher's showing you respect. Somehow, I doubt it. Would you like to sit down, Lord Whitehill? Aye. And get me something to drink. I'm bloody parched. Talia, why don't you fetch the wine for his lordship? We thought you'd like to sit here, Lord Whitehill. I'll sit there. Thank you very much. In the Lord's chair. It's not like your father wanted your worthless ass in it. Our hall is yours, Lord Whitehill. Make yourself comfortable. Of course it's my bloody hall. But you're too ready to give it over. Your false smiles don't fool me, Forrester. Calm down, Father. Asher's just showing you the respect you deserve. So, Lord Forrester. You made your way as a soul sword out there, did you? Eh, a little rape, a little murder. Anything for the right price. And your family must be so proud. And all those bed slaves a soul sword must enjoy across a narrow sea. Oh, I can't imagine how my sister will be able to please you. I think we're ready for the wine, Talia. Aye. Why? Enough bloody nattering! Sit the hell down, Griff, and let's drink! A toast. We should make a toast. Ah. What shall we toast to? Come on, then. Let's hear it. Don't make me sit here waiting to drink. To the alliance between our families, House Forrester and House Whitehill, let us put the bloodshed behind us. To, to our, our families. families. No, no, no. This isn't right. You first, then me. In the way of the North. Come, Forrester. Let's drink together as lords of our houses. Let me. Let it be you and I who seal this bond. For our houses. For our children. Iron 
from ice. Mother. Hmm. Not bad. Water. Bring me water. He's choking. Help him. You. Betrayed! They killed my father! Attack! Attack! Take down the gate! We can't fight that many! We're doomed! If they breach the gate, we're done for! We can't fight the entire White Hill Army! My lord, your wound... Get them to safety. Of course, my lord. I want to stay with you, Asher. Please, Talia. Yeah, West. 
after us. Let's give those fuckers a welcome to remember. a long way to die. Let's see you live up to your reputation. Another law die on my watch. I can't run. You must survive, Asher. For the house. For all of us that fought this day. Now.
Asha? My lord. We don't have much time. They may have won this battle, but they will not win this war.